What's up guys, it's Mac Geek Alex here and I'm here to show you how you can use the standard headsets that came together with your Galaxy Nexus. I have them here, these are the Samsung headsets, um, the stock headsets that came with um, my Galaxy Nexus that you see here. And um, there is a microphone on the, volume, on the controls here and there's also a one button control here. So these features have been pretty standard for the iPhone. Um, and so far we've not had uh, controls available until Jelly Bean. So this is a Galaxy Nexus um, running Jelly Bean here. And let's go ahead and see what this button can do. So the first thing you can do is you can start or stop playing music with just one click. So clicking once will cause music to play and clicking again will pause it. And this works even if it's turned off. So I'm not sure you can, can hear the music there, but you can start playing and stop playing. So let's just show you the screen here. I can start playing music and stop playing music. And another thing you can do is I can skip tracks by double clicking on the button. So if you pay attention to the tracks up here, you see that I'm able to skip forward through the album. Um, unfortunately, um, you're not able to skip to the previous track yet. So hopefully Google will come up with that feature sometime soon. And this works with a couple of apps. So you know, if you have a podcast player like Beyond Pod, which I don't have installed yet, that should still work. And even if you've quit out of the app, so let me quit out of Google Music. It will still play. Um, let me just show you here. So I'm just going to one click on here, single click. And I'll start playing the music. And single click again, stops playing the music. Start again, skip forward, next track. And again, next track. All right, so that was just a quick video to show you how you can use um, the control buttons on the standard headsets that come with the Galaxy Nexus uh, if you're running Android Jelly Bean 4.1. So thanks for watching.